What could it be? A glitch in the matrix? Could someone else be involved? Where could a whole planet disappear to? In 2004, when NASA first discovered Dagon, something seemed off right from the start. It was behaving strangely, defying the odds. Because according to what we knew, planets like Dagon that are two to three times the size of Jupiter shouldn't have been able to form around such a young star like Fomalhaut, which is just 400 million years old. Our Sun, for comparison, is about 4.6 billion years old. Additionally, since its star is surrounded by a protoplanetary disk of gas, ice, and dust, the first planets to appear around it should be superheated and glow in the infrared instead of this Dagon that emits ultraviolet light. Moreover, that planet was incredibly radiant, shining with an intensity rarely observed on exoplanets.